What is going on guys? We're back with some more Dragon Ball Z Dokken Battle videos on the Japanese version and we are here today guys to awaken my Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black. Now I pulled him on the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta banner when I was doing my crazy ridiculous line of summons <laughs> and uh, we finally pulled the man himself. We finally got this card. Uh, why am I in the training section? Why? <laughs> uh, let me go ahead to the awakening section but we finally got the card. When the banner uh, for this guy first dropped originally, when uh, it was him and Super Saiyan Blue Vegito, I didn't pull for him because I didn't think I didn't think he was that good. I really didn't think he was that amazing. And uh, I went ham on Super Saiyan Blue Vegito, and I got Super Saiyan Blue Vegito. But then when I started by running Super Saiyan um, Rose Goku Black, I was like, damn, I wish I had him as well because he's just so freaking good. <laughs> and um, even though the uh, the, the new uh, Mono AGL leader, uh, which is um, you know Super Saiyan Four Vegeta. Uh, although he gives his leadership ability to super characters, meaning the heroes, you can still run a villain on the team like Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black, and he'll still be pretty decent because he does have prepared for battle, he does give himself his own key, he doesn't get the big HP attack and defense stat boost, but uh, he can actually do without. Uh, he's still a pretty good unit just as is. So, my mine is a super attack one, I have very little dupe system stuff going on with him. I have him uh, able to do an additional attack, um, I have him at, you know, base that so I have nothing you know really big going on with him as yet like I said I have Super Saiyan 4 uh, you know Vegeta I also have him I have some other units as well that I'm trying to put through the dupe system that are also AGL units so it is it is difficult to, to uh, get all of these units um, into the dupe system and get them there get them the attention they need because you you like you need one type of ore for like three or four different characters so <laughs> you got you kind of got to pick and choose but anyways guys Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black, yes, 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 <laughs> man, oh man, I, I've won this car for so long, my uh, dude Shiny, <laughs> Shiny, um, yo, like, he went hard trying to pull this man, <laughs> my dude put in damn near a thousand stones on the original Super Saiyan, uh, Rose Goku Black trying to pull this man, and he just couldn't do it, he pulled a lot of good shit, just not Super Saiyan, uh, Rose Goku Black, and um, when I when I uh, pulled him on the Super Saiyan 4 banner, I was like, oh, Shiny, oh, because he wanted him so bad, and I hope he, I hope he gets him uh, sometime in the future. He's another YouTuber. If you don't know who Shiny is, a uh, pretty cool guy. But uh, here is Super Saiyan uh, Rose Goku Black, one of the only cars in the game who have, in my opinion, better art when they doken as opposed to their previous SSR art. So I love the art, freaking amazing. I love the red, you know, kind of like swirl of like the whirlwind coming around him with the orbs that he's holding. Freaking amazing. I love it. And if you don't know, he is the villain's leader. Three key HP attack and defense up for uh, extreme types, meaning all the villains. Uh, he does have an extreme modifier. I think he also greatly reduces defense. And uh, he gives three key to all villains, and he gets 100% on conditional attack up as a passive. Clutch, 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 clutch. He does have links like big bad bosses. He does have prepared for battle. Although he's a villain, he's still a Saiyan because that is Goku's body, so he does have prepared for battle. Uh, I don't. I, he might have fair and faith as well. I think he might have fair and faith. Uh, which, if he does, and that's freaking amazing. He's a definitely a clutch unit. But um, you know, they really didn't need him need to give him prepare for battle. They really didn't. But with him having that prepare for battle link, giving himself two key uh, when he's linked with other prepare for battle units, that makes him even more of a broken unit. Now, if I were to structure a villains team, I'm gonna go over a villains team. that I'm gonna show you my uh, mono HL team with uh, my Vegeta. Well, currently this is my villain team with a uh, Merge the Monster lead because I didn't have uh, Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black previously. But now that I do, I can actually implement him um, in the place of Merge the Monster. But I can actually keep Merge the, Merge the Monster as a leader, to be honest, because now that I have a Rose of my own, um, I can have. Um, well, I don't know if I'll do that. What I was thinking that I can have uh, one Rose come in each turn. That way we can get his three key of the passive because Merge the Monster only gives one key. Um, to extreme types so you know it might be a little difficult getting key off with a merge monster lead but if you do have double rules coming in each turn uh, that possibility to give you three key for all the allies is going to be clutch plus all the unit share links like you know shopping speed fair and faith um, I don't think there's any other links going on here though uh, I think Goku Black and uh, Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black I think they both have prepared for battle like, I think so just those two units though because they're same bodies of course but uh, this is pretty much my um, team here if I were to make a switch um, uh, I mean I really can't switch anyone out this is actually the perfect team this is literally the team that you want to run I mean maybe maybe Goku Black for a unit like full power freezer if you do have full power freezer 
uh, freezer, well, freezer at Super Attack 10. Uh, or if you want to switch out Goku Black for for cell, um, the um, uh, the Strength Demigod cell, pretty good uh, alternative there as well. But uh, for the most part, this is going to be your ideal villain team. Now going on to your Mono AGL team, if you do have Super Saiyan Form, I do have mine. I just pulled them yesterday. Just sorry, I got a, I got a bit of a burp. Sorry about that, but I just pulled them yesterday. So I haven't had the opportunity to farm with the metal because I've been farming so many units, guys. <laughs> like I said, I pulled him, I pulled Super Saiyan 4 Goku, I pulled Super Saiyan 3 uh, GT Goku, I pulled Rose, I pulled, you know, the new pan. I pulled so many cars that need uh, metals to awaken. I pulled Ultimate Gohan AGL. Like, I, I, need to do, I need to do so much farming, guys. Uh, Goku Black has to be the most annoying because you have to farm his Super Attack first. Uh, by uh, by getting the uh, base S the SSR tech cards and then you have to feed them into his uh, super attack to raise it and um, I've been doing that event over and over and over and over and over and over again and I'll get one drop every like 10 turns and the one card doesn't even raise a super attack because it's a 50% chance so I'm so fucking triggered by Goku Black I'm so triggered the drop rate sucks and it doesn't even get the super attack up and I can't awaken him until I get a super attack up to 10 and I have the medals are sitting there but whatever guys so this is the ideal team here. Uh, actually, I would actually switch out a Raleigh. I would uh, for Ultimate Gohan, but the thing about Ultimate Gohan, he's not awakened. Like I said, I just pulled him, so I need to farm the metals. Where's Ultimate Gohan? Here, he no, that's Goku. Uh, here he is, Ultimate Gohan. So I would swap out Ultimate Gohan for Raleigh because Ultimate Gohan and Raleigh they, they do the same thing. But the thing about Gohan, he has a fair battle link, and he links better with the Saiyans. Uh, so you definitely want to get that going on there. Um, you can actually switch out, I mean, you know, if you really want to switch out a unit, you can switch out God Goku here. Um, for a unit like, I don't even know, um, I mean, you definitely want a unit with, you know, for the most part, you want to have a Fierce Battle, um, a, a unit with Fierce Battle, or if you want to get a unit with the GT link, just to give uh, Vegeta a bit more key. Um, I mean, if, if you want, you can use Super Saiyan 3 Goku, but I don't like that passive. Like, you guys know that I'm not a big fan of this Goku because his passive lasts for 7 turns. He gets... 100% attack up when performing a super, but it's passive, guys. Like it lasts for seven turns. And these days, uh, with the way the game's going, you know, we had bosses with damn seven, uh, eight, ten health bars. You know, soon coming now. So his pass is not gonna last you ten health bars. So you definitely wanna keep a solid unit that's gonna be a bit more consistent. The new game trunks is an option because he does have the GT link. Uh, this Goku here actually does get a rebirth, but I haven't rebirthed him as yet because. I just don't really care for the rebirth cards, but um, if I were to really put another unit in its place, I would honestly maybe go with this Goku here. Uh, Super Saiyan 3 GT uh, Kid Goku here, pretty good passive, he does have a GT link, uh, he does have Odin and Flash as well, so he will be linking with uh, Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken, so we actually do put him in place of this Goku. Um, so he shares links with uh, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, he shares links with Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku, and um, I, I, he doesn't have sure he doesn't have a uh, shocking speed. I don't know if he has prepared for battle. He might. I don't really think he does. I think he only has a GT and the over the flash link. Uh, in that case, he doesn't really fit well on this team. He only gives key to those two units. But either way, guys, you can interchange that one unit. You know, um, you can really do a lot here. Um, I don't have every AGL unit in the game, of course. But um, ideally, you know, you definitely want to get another unit with that prepared for battle link and also that um actually Barris. Wow. This bear is actually has shocking speed, and the majority units minus Goku Black has shocking speed, so you can do a lot right there with that last slot. But for the most part, you want to be consistent with the Super Saiyan 4. Uh, you want to be consistent with the Super Saiyan Rose with Black. If you want Super Vegito there, you pretty much are going to put either Super Saiyan Blue Kao Ken Goku or the original Super Saiyan Blue Goku that uh, got a got a Dokken Awakening with his event, and you know Ultimate Gohan. He stuns. He has a pretty good passive as well. So that's going to be there, guys. I talk quite a bit. Um, I guess it went into like an awakening, then it went to like a team building alternative. A lot of you guys ask me to do a lot of team building stuff. I don't do a lot of team building uh, videos on the channel because that's more of like Alex um, and D Free stuff. I don't really want to take their content and make it my own. Granted, I mean, this is Dokkan, it's one game. We all play the game, so our content is going to cross, you know, and interchange uh, every now and then. But, uh, sorry, I got a bit of a stuffy nose. I feel like I'm getting. <coughs> sorry about that. I feel like getting a bit of a cold, sorry about that, but if you guys want to see more uh, team building videos, let me know down in the comment section. <coughs> sorry about that, I gotta like blow my nose, guys. Anyways, <laughs> please like the video, share the video, comment down below, guys. See you in another video, thank you so much. Bye-bye.